the constitution of india preamble we the people of india having solemnly resolved to constitute india into a sovereign socialist secular democratic republic and to secure to all its citizens justice social economic and political liberty of thought expression belief faith and worship equality of status and of opportunity and to promote among them all fraternity assuring the dignity of the individual and the unity and integrity of the nation in our constituent assembly this 26th day of november 1949 do hereby adopt enact and give to ourselves this constitution hello my dear snappy children welcome back to the world of poetry classes i hope you are fine as you all know it's very hot now right so take care of your health drink plenty of water and have so many fruits and vegetables okay so let's begin today's session in today's class let us concentrate on some writing discourses so first let us see how to write a profile so children first we must know what is a profile right profile is an information about a person's life work interest etc so what is a profile it is an information about a person's life work interest etc and it highlights the personal details and major achievements of the person so while writing a profile you must include his work interest then his personal details and also major achievements of the person so this is about a profile now let us see how to write a profile or what is the format of writing a profile Yes, children. So while writing a profile, you have to keep in mind all these points. That is, read the information and details of the person. So if you are asked to write a profile, the information and details of the person will be given. So read that information and details of the person. After that, give a suitable title. Most probably, you have to write the name of that person. Okay. Then use simple and clear language. while writing a profile or if somebody is reading that profile that person should get a clear idea about the particular person so you have to use simple and clear language use suitable descriptive vocabulary that is use of appropriate adjectives for describing that particular person you can use appropriate adjectives so these are the points you have to note while writing a profile Yes children let us move on to the next topic that is speech you all may be familiar with this topic speech what is a speech a speech is an effective verbal communication made by a person addressing a group of people filled with facts and novel ideas so what is a speech it is an effective verbal communication made by a person to a group of people and the person who is delivering the speech always speaks about facts and novel ideas you know how to deliver a speech or you may be familiar with delivering a speech but while preparing a speech or while writing a speech you have to keep in mind certain points so now let's have a look Yes children so while delivering a speech or while writing a speech you should begin with a salutation so like respected principal teachers or respected dignitaries on the dais like that you can begin the speech so after writing the salutation you have to leave a line then you have to introduce the topic first identify the topic and arrange logically that is it should have an introduction then body paragraphs and a conclusion or concluding paragraphs then while writing a speech you can include quotes of famous person 
then anecdotes incidents relevant to the topic so while writing a speech or to make it more attractive you can include all these things like quotes anecdotes incidents which are very much relevant to the topic so it it will become more effective another thing is develop the topic with a variety of supporting ideas as i told before it should have a good introduction then body paragraphs and also a conclusion so each paragraph should be linked or it should have a connection okay then present your views so just imagine if you got a if you get a topic use of internet or use of technology first you have to introduce the topic or what is internet like that after that you have to mention the important points like the advantages disadvantages like that you have to go on conclude the speech effectively so the concluding paragraph is also very important it should not be abrupt and you have to give a proper conclusion or a proper solution to the topic so this is all about writing or preparing a speech so children let's move on to the final topic that is character sketch what is the character sketch a character sketch is an analysis of a character in a story or a play so what is a character sketch it is an analysis of a character in a story or a play that is about character sketch while writing a character sketch you have to keep in mind certain points yes children while writing a character sketch first you have to identify the role played by the character in the story or uh, in a story or a play first you have to identify the role played by the character then describe the character's physique that is physical appearance of the character then positive and negative features so then you have to mention the physical appearance then both positive and negative features then describe the personality traits like manners behaviors values etc if the person possesses a certain manner or certain behavior you can include that also in a character sketch then write about character's relationship with other characters in the story so in a play or in a story you have to mention the character's relationship with other characters in the story so this is all about writing a character sketch yes children so all these writing discourses are very very important so copy the notes then try to write at least one example for each discourses okay without reading and writing you cannot improve your language so always read and write let's wind up the session meet you in the next class till then it's bye from your apna teacher thank you